Kilo Vets. It's a local Tucson non all volunteer nonprofit. They're cyclists, volunteers, and supporters focused on enriching the lives of veterans in our community by sharing the physical and mental benefits of cycling and camaraderie. There's something very relaxing about getting on your bike and going for a ride. How you doing? You know, I, I rode in the El Tour de Tucson about six years ago, did all 109 miles. I didn't touch my bike for a year after that. <laughs> it's time to get back on the saddle again, right? <laughs> Thanks for coming out, guys. Some nice looking bicycles in there. Entry number 90, still continue with the Velo Vets. I join you? <laughs> I gotta fix my flats. You guys still having fun out there? Can you imagine, another three years from now, it's gonna be the 100th anniversary. So keep that in mind. It's been going on for a long time, one of Tucson's longest traditions today happening. Here we have Tucson Veterans Serving Veterans. The mission of this group is to help veterans achieve independence and self-sufficiency. And most members do this by getting help veterans to get them stable, get them well-paying jobs. Some TVSV members help veterans overcome barriers such as homelessness. Thank you very much. You're a little cutie. Thank you. Thank you very much. They provide a spectrum of services leading to fulfillment of their mission. Together, we can make a difference. And here we have the Tucson Customs and Border Protection Office of Field Operations. Explorers Post 2600 is committed to the partnership between law enforcement and America's youth. Bridging one of the most challenging missions in law enforcement today, the job of serving the guardians of our nation's borders, America's front lines. And is that one of their helicopters as we speak? There we go. Did you guys plan that flyover? Here we have the Wildcat Honor Guard, the University of Arizona Air Force ROTC's Wildcat Honor Guard, representing and honoring the service members of today, yesterday, and tomorrow. Followed by the University of Arizona Air Force ROTC, Detachment 20. The cadets of Detachment, Detachment 20, University of Arizona's Air Force Reserve Officer Training Corps, developing leaders of tomorrow for the finest Air Force the world has ever seen. Entry number 95 is Rally Point, Arizona. It's a veterans initiative of La Frontera, Arizona. Rally Point, Arizona is a navigator and mentorship program that is staffed by veterans who specialize in community resource navigation and veterans advocacy. RPA's professional staff has received specialized training in veteran services and community mental health support services. Tucson City Court asked Rally Point to provide mentorship programs and support to veterans that are participating in the Regional Municipalities Veterans Treatment Court. Here we have the Mayor's Veterans Affairs Committee. City of Tucson Mayor Jonathan Rothschild was part of this and getting this started. Affairs Committee members are Carol Rundell, Luke Johnson, and Terry Byron. The 1959 Ford Fairlane is driven by owner Alex Chavez. And here we have Cub Scout Pack 757. Thanks for coming out today, guys. Here we have Veterans for Peace. They say, we have served our nation, do hereby affirm our greater responsibility to serve the cause of world peace. To achieve goals, members of Veterans for Peace pledge to use nonviolent means to maintain an organization that is both democratic and open with the understanding that all members are trusted to act in the best interest of the group for the larger purpose of world peace. All right, this is a really cool Jeep. I love this thing. This is Ben Knuckles, U.S. Army 814th Combat Engineers Cold War. Ben, thanks for coming out and showing off that really cool Jeep you got. Thank you. Appreciate that. You can hear them coming, so let's